Welcome, folks. This is Tom O'Brien of TFNN. We go five days a week. We go seven hours a day. We go 24 hours a day in the internet at TFNN.com. Always remember, folks, whatever you think about, you bring about whatever you focus on grows. Hope everyone's having a great day, safe day. Let's make it a great night, folks. Create the perfect relationship between you and your body. Treat your body with all love, honor, gratitude, and respect. When you make it a goal to adore your body and accept yourself completely, you'll learn to have the perfect relationship with anyone else you are with. Market wise, let's take a look at it out here. We have the Dow Industrials down 445, NASDAQ off 193, S&P's off 63. Gold, gold contract down uh, up $15.70, trading at 1834 an ounce. We have silver off four cents, twenty dollars eleven cents an ounce. Light sweet crude down a buck six, seventy-five dollars sixty cents a barrel. Notes and bonds. You get the ten-year note up eighteen ticks, trading one eleven sixteen. The thirty-year up fourteen at one twenty-five twenty-five. And king dollar, king dollar is down three hundred sixty ticks, trading one hundred five two ninety-eight. The euro is at 105, the yen's at 136, and the British pound is at 119 to 1 US dollar. Our phone number is 877-927-6648. Give us a call, folks. Want to know what's going on in your world? In the world of the S&Ps, let's take a look at them. What do you have? Well, bottom line, folks, is that we're going to be going after this B point of a potential ABC structure on the way down. Right now, you are down $6.30. We're at 392.56, and this is going to be really strange, man. It's going to get, it's going to, uh, let me look at this, man. It might, it just very well might go after it, and we're going to, I suspect we're going to get the volume. Yeah, it's going to go after it, man. We're getting too close. Okay, here, yeah, let me get the futures up. This is wild. Okay, so, let's see, what, yeah, it's a straight line move, man. We're going to go after it, so we'll see what ends up happening. We'll see if we get the, uh, the volume on inside of the spy and it's it'll be a close call but i think you can get it particularly because when you're breaking lows um what do we need you need 17 million from now but we just did three million from the point of me doing the update to just now, so it can get it. That's the bottom line. We go to the gold contract. We take a look at the gold contract out here. What we have inside the gold contract is that, you know, we came down hard, 245,000 contracts. You're bouncing with 194, which is not bad, by the way. Okay, it's, that's not bad. There's no doubt. We'll see what kind of follow through we get through. That, now, this is, a, this is a confirmed ABC structure down already. And then there's another B point that it just missed going after yesterday. So we'll see how that baby shakes out. We go into the... Uh, dollar, because it's uh, the, the dollar bottom line. And now, what you, we're seeing out here today is that you have a down market, the dollar is down. Like, you can imagine what it would be up. Now, the dollar is just backing down just a bit. So, bottom line, lower prices coming out of us. You know, yeah, and yesterday, folks, when I finished the show, one of the Tigers put up the regional banks inside the Tigers' den, and I was showing that when I finished the show, it was an ABC structure down. Well, you talk about getting smoked. It was an ABC structure down, all right. This baby. So, here is where. Here's where you, you took out the B point yesterday. Whoops, there we go. Okay, so you took out the B point yesterday. The the B point, yeah. Well, the B point first off on this uh, was uh, 59.05, and and it needed 10 million shares. Well, we took it out yesterday with 13 million, and today all the financials imploded, folks. I mean, in a monster way. You're talking about it. Doesn't matter. It's we'll go through. Uh, in fact, one of the first calls is talking about banks. We'll go through the aspect, but uh, the first thing that we, we all should actually look at, forget the regional banks, check, it, check out the large banks, okay? This just spooked them all, okay? J.P. Morgan's down seven bucks. Volume explodes outside. It's been in a consolidation. This thing wants a lower price. In fact, if J.P. Morgan wants lower price, they're all going lower. Let's take this and we'll put this on like a, put this on a 10-year monthly and see where we're at. Okay, so from the last high to where we were, it did uh, almost a 0.6 way. It didn't get it. So I suspect what we have now is that now, you, you know, bottom line, you're going to go right back to the lows that were generated out here in October. And those lows, uh, that's 101. Let's go to Garrow and Newport Beach. Hey, Garrow, what's going on, brother? How are you, sir? I'm doing great, man. Yourself? 
Good, thank you. Thank you for asking. Um, so, Brian, I need your idea regarding SIVB. Uh, it's a financial group. I want to know that when, when is going to be the next support. I shorted at $140 today, and still I'm in the short. I want to know that uh, where do you think that's going to be the next uh, uh, support? Okay, so let's take a look at this. The high for the year, uh, this is Silicon Valley Bank, folks. That's what this is. This is the holding company for Silicon, Silicon Valley Bank. The high is 597 for the year. The low is 100. Uh, this has been a, no doubt, a straight line move down. As Garrow said, it opened this morning at $176. Uh, it's off $165. And what's going on here, folks, is this. So you get a couple of different things going on with Silicon Valley Bank. The, they're coming out with, they need capital. That's the bottom line. When you cut through all the chase, they need capital and they need monster capital and they're going to come out with it. And maybe come out with paper. Paper in an extraordinary way. Um, okay, so you blew through 137. The next leg there is somewhere about 92, 93. You know, so... You know, you, what, you don't, what we don't know, Garrow, is that what is the price they're going to come out with the paper? And what this has yeah. to do with, folks, okay, this has to do with bottom line. Now, you normally don't see banks implode like this, okay? This is an aspect, I suspect, they need cash, and they need cash because what's going to happen, what has happened here is that you have a mock to market on the securities that they're holding, and more than likely, this is, this is the big tech bank, okay? They probably have securities that they've taken in kind versus um, the aspect of even getting fees. They had a mock to mock them. They more than likely have bonds on their books that what ends up happening with them, they're going to mock them to market. You know, Garrow, I just keep bringing your stop down, man. That's the bottom line. Don't, you know, you shot, you're going to buy it back. That's it. I see. I see. You don't think it's going to go to $80 that happened in 2020? I, I don't know. Listen, man, you know, you're down a hundred and something dollars today. So, yeah. yeah. <laughs> Very good. Thank you, sir. Okay, Thanks man. So Have a great one. Thanks. Have a safe one. Stay right there, folks. We'll come right back. And, uh, you know, we'll see whether that's the one that, it, more than likely, that's the one that just slammed everything else too, folks. Okay. But what it showed is that as the Tigers are saying, when the, when the Tigers out, you find out who doesn't have a bait and suit on.